Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to my Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma 2. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am, and I am extremely excited to play this game. I cannot wait to jump in. I have played the first Dragon's Dogma about a billion times. I'm exaggerating, but it, I played it a lot. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start the game. On a guess, lend me your ears. Long as our Febramon suffered without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Decades have passed since last His Majesty Erland sat atop the Draken throne. Long have we endured, yet it has not been for naught. At last, the bell has tolled on the age of the Consul. At last, we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. The return of the Sovereign. My word, such an inspiring visage. Your Majesty shall have my eternal yeah, fealty. No Your Majesty, eternal. oh how long I have awaited this moment. Behold, before you sits the rightful inheritor of the Draken throne, chosen by the dragon as its enemy. Behold and rejoice! Fortune has delivered us our savior at last! At last! Praise be, for only the Sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the Sovereign! All hail! Let all present Pledge your allegiance to the Sovereign. Let us be united in the hope that our liege's reign will near end. Long live the Sovereign of Vermont! Long live the Sovereign! Arisen, thou who wouldst slay the dragon, if thou seekest to behold this world in its true aspect, abandon thy reason. Cast aside thine heart and thy life, both. I ask thee to demonstrate thy will, for naught but thine ambition can alter the course of the rivers of fate.
Now, which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. So, I did make a preset character. Aha! Uh -huh. I thought I recognized you. This is my preset. We're going to go with an archer. I was debating between a thief and an archer. But my first run, I kind of want to be an archer, if not a magic archer. Let's go ahead and finalize. I ill like that look in your eyes. Tis queerly brazen for a pawn. Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. Mayhap tis only natural seeing as how you rise from the dead. There's aught different about you, though. Could it be that you fear death just as we mortals do? Worry not, Vessel. Three days here, and you'll be longing for death's sweet embrace. Come along, you feckless dullards. That's from the pre-order. We are playing on a PS5, just to let everybody know. That looks cool. What do you think you're up to, layabout? Get a move on! Do your injuries pain you? Pray, do not overexert yourself. Hey, look, it's Rook. He's from the uh, first Dragon's Dogma. This is no place for one of your ilk. Tis harsh beyond measure. Even we pawns are pushed to the brink. You ought not anger the Overseer. Let us proceed to the site. So Rook is the first pawn that you'll run into in Dragon's Dogma 1. So I wonder if they're doing the same thing with Dragon's Dogma 2 as well. He is following us along. Don't really know where I'm going. Time for you to get to work. All this worrying is giving me an achy back. You are prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying stones out from the station in the back and bringing them here. Okay. Pretty simple. Oh, we can turn our lantern on. Oh, yes, that is nice. Before, <laughs> with the quick slots. The vicinity is quite cluttered. Pray leap, or oh, 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 that poses a hindrance to you. Um, before it was such a hassle to turn on the lantern.
Character slows down up hills. That's pretty cool. A job well done. Now the next step is to... What is this commotion? Perhaps we ought to investigate. Perhaps so. Now, I have watched a lot of the promotional trailers and everything for this game. So I have a feeling I know what this is. Even at the cost of your lives! Yeah, I kind of figured that this was the Medusa fight. The Pretty cool. A proper distance and careful. Okay. If your foes should draw too near, counter them with a well-aimed kick. Boulders, barrels, and the like can make effective weapons with a clever combatant. What is with Rook? What is going on with him? He's just floating in the air. When delivering targeted strikes, I would recommend clinging to your foe. Escaped. Oh, you get back here. Uh, quickly. Uh, this way, arisen. Uh, Come this way. Let us flee. Circle in L3 to dash. That encounter reminded me a lot of the Hydra fight from Dragon's Dogma 1. You must jump. No one could survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn. Don't just stand there. Shoot it down. It's getting away. Bring it down. Bring it down. Go now, lost soul. And learn all you can of this world you must protect.
Pray, keep your distance, Arisen. Worry not for me. The brine may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a rift stone. Pray, seek it out. If you're truly the Arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. Oi! Are you all right? What happened here? A griffin appears one moment and falls the next, and now you stand before me. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? It is a wonder you survived. Accompany me to the stronghold. We'll treat your wounds and hear your story. Man, that's messed up that they shot the griffin. Like... <laughs> And they saw two people on it. Like, oh, let's shoot it. Even though there's two people on it. I don't know. Maybe they thought that we were trying to attack them or something. Possibly. Uh, but I was hoping that we might be able to get a griffin mount or something. But I guess not. Um, also, the brine looks pretty cool. And Dragon's Dogma 1, it didn't have that much of an animation. Okay, talk about debilitation. I oh, it swallowed me. Oops. I didn't think it was gonna swallow me. I thought I okay makes sense. <laughs> cool animation. All right, I'll quit messing around. We'll continue forward. Where exactly is this jail you say you escaped from, anyway? I've never heard of such a place. There's certainly naught like that here in Vermont. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Batal? No. Green Orsh? Where are you going? I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Goblins. Fine! Goblins! Let's take up your weapon, sir. You'll be needing it. If you find your strength flagging, imbibe a curative or have a bit of green wine. When one of the fiends comes for you, best guard or dodge, else you'll be sore on the morrow. There are oft items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. If you're not squeamish about picking at their bones, that is. Okay. Have you beheld the dragon as yet? I've not, and I count that a blessing. All I know for sure is that tis a beast e'er more fearsome than a griffin. One need only look to the miserable state of the village of Nell to see that. We can but hope that the Sovereign will rid us of it ere long. More goblins. Whoa! You just came out of nowhere. Oops. You alright, bud? No mean beast to be sure. Where do you think you're going? Oh shit. You can't just run off now. I'm not trying to. I'm almost dead though. Good thing I have some green wars. Dude, you guys fuck off. Thank you, sir. Level two. Uh, it looks like leveling up does not completely refill your health like it does in the first one.
Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? The pawns? They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way. Before you stands a rift stone. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross o'er into this world. Pray, summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you. That was really pretty. Uh, yep, we already have an existing pawn. This is our existing pawn here. She's going to be a mage. Her name is Lucy. Pawns are known as crosses of the rift, for we are able to connect to and traverse other realms beyond this one. When we return, it is our duty to use our experiences and the knowledge we have gained to aid you on your journey arisen. From this day forth, I shall serve you as your loyal pawn, and aught I learn beyond the rift will be at your disposal. Well, I'll be a pawn summoning before my very eyes. You truly are the arisen then. Strange. I thought the arisen was in the capital. Surely there's only meant to be one arisen. Fine. This is all beyond my ken. The watchhead would know what to do, I'm sure. Though, as luck would have it, he's away. I suppose we'll save any further questions till the watchhead returns. You're free to do as you like afore then. What? You've no memories, you say? Mayhap you could make for Melv, then. It was set upon by the dragon not long ago. The Arisen is said to bear some deep connection to the dragon. Should you be Arisen, mayhap you'll recall aught of import there. Border Watch Outpost. Riftstones. Um, okay, that's where we can summon pawns. Hail, Arisen. Pray, ask aught you wish to know. I shall answer, if tis within my power to do so. Uh, tell me of the pawns. Nomads, we are oft called. Born in other worlds, we travel here by means of the rift stones that we might aid you, Arisen. However, I cannot speak as to our true nature, for I know of it not. None of us do. We do not need to. We merely do as we are commanded. Tell me a little bit of the rift stones. Rift stones are gates that connect this world to a multitude of others. By their power have we crossed into this world. And when our mission is done, by their power shall we return to our own. And what of the Arisen? Tis the name given to fates chosen. Those destined to command the Pawn Legion and safeguard the world from the threat of the dragon. Even with your memories lost to you, I am afraid you cannot escape your fate. Okay, that's all I need to know. Very well. May fortune speed you on your way, Arisen. Let's go ahead and hire some pawns. Wow, that's really cool. That loaded in super fast. I like that. <laughs> Side piece. Okay. 
Shelly, we need a warrior. That's what we need. The myth? Sure. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat's thrills to gathering items. I am confident and may act independently. Sure. Ah, good. I see the Arisen's found someone to handle our busy work. Pawn quests are tasks given to your main pawn to be completed beyond the rift. You set the task and must stipulate a reward for the Arisen who hires your main pawn to receive upon the task completion. Pawn quests provide valuable opportunities for you to obtain items and acquire pawn badges. You should endeavor to get your pawn hired as often as possible. When setting a reward for the Arisen who hires your main pawn to receive, you can either select specific items or nominate a sum of gold. Items will be removed from your inventory. Gold will be subtracted from your funds. It is also possible to trade with other Arisens by setting the retrieval of items you desire as the pawn's quest uh, object. Cool, that's a very unique a uh, trading system. Very unique. Pike. I was hoping to find um, Rook in here, but I don't see Rook. Can we can we examine this? View view unique pawns, the official pawns. Okay. These are special pawns that can be hired from the official pawn selection of the Riftstone menu. They differ from regular pawns in the following ways. Their names are displayed in different colors. Official pawns of level 10 and below can be hired without expending Rift Crystals. The armor worn by official pawns cannot be changed. Official pawns will not appear in monthly or calumet... Um, whatever I'm not even trying right now rankings and may be ex excluded from other aspects of the game words am I right uh, additionally official pawns may only be available for hire for a limited time check our website for details about the availability availability of official pawns okay Dora, okay. It's hoping to find Rook. No Rook. Okay. Oof. Wow. Okay. Search for a pawn. Advanced pawn search. Friends pawns. Nope. Okay, so we got a mage, we have a um, fighter, so maybe we get a another archer, maybe that'll do. Tis a pleasure to meet you. Sabine, you can roll with us for a little bit. If we share our strengths, we can begin formulating a strategy that caters to our respective skills. Okay, let's exit the rift. That's so fast. That's so fast. 
See if we can't help anybody around here. You need any help? Is there all you require? Guess not. Having more of these to hand ought serve us well in battle. Let us take care when and how we put them to use. Wake powder. Wonder if we can get up there. No, we can't jump high enough. We're not tall enough either. Don't know if that even plays a role. I know that height, uh, weight, and everything plays a role in, you know, your abilities to do stuff like that. But, I mean, in the aspect of being able to grab up top there. Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. There's a ladder here. Going out, are you? You sure that's a good idea? You seem rather unwell. You ought at least rest for the evening. There should be a spare bed in the lodgings yonder. Only don't go rushing off before you're ready. Take it from me. You're better off resting while you have the chance. Okay. Well, I want to explore a little bit before we get to doing that. Age, scrag, scrag of What are beast. you doing? We've not been given lead to rest yet. <laughs> oh my god, are you serious? Uh, that's really funny looking. Look at this shit. Nah, can't really see it with the pawns in the way. That shit looked really silly. Got to crack a few skulls if you want to be top dog. Auto-save data cannot be relied upon to save your progress in this world. It is recommended that you rest at ends at regular intervals if you wish to ensure the reliability of your save data. Okay, so it looks like resting is going to be our main save. No longer, I don't think. Can we save in here? Uh, we can save and continue, I suppose. There used to be a, a quick thing in the Dragon's Dogma 1 where you could hit the middle pad on the PlayStation and that would do a quick save. But I guess they did not add that in here. Ooh, what's that? Scrag a beast. Ripened horse bud. Pud. Oh, <laughs> I'm trying to use the wrong thing. That's it. It was well worth the effort of breaking it. Oh, sheath weapon. Cool. Okay. L2 is to sheath weapon. Oh, did I piss you guys off? Oh, shit. I'm sorry. I didn't realize I could do that. Good to know. Good to know. Hey, bud. I've got wares of every ilk. Let's sell some stuff. Not going to be using Scrag a Beast at the moment. Uh, maybe make some arrows. Uh, I'm not going to get rid of any of that stuff yet. Hope to see you again here long. Not buying? That's just as well. Better to be selective than wasteful. Browsing That's right, Lucy. was enough to you scratch the itch in my case. Hoi there. You seem well tired. Tell you what. You can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect coin from tomorrow, mind. My pa always used to say, there's naught a good night's sleep can't fix. Not much else I can offer, I'm afraid, but you'll find all sorts at a finer inn. Aye, being armed is better than being defenseless, even if you're untrained. Still, it is worth devoting yourself to a vocation if you can. Opens up new doors, it does. You should stop by the inn in Melv if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. They've much more to offer. Um, yeah, staying at ends restores your health and stamina and all that good stuff. Aye, 
Being armed is better than being defenseless. Even you should stop by the inn in Melville. Okay, you so you're chance. just gonna repeat what no you just said? If you prefer it, they've much more to offer. We must rest, though the sun is still up. Newfound strength, course. One or more add-ons acquired. Sent to my storage. It is through you. It is good to see. There's no discipline that steadfast devotion cannot teach. I've beds to spare if you're looking for lodgings. And if you'd like to change your vocation, come see me anytime. Uh, withdraw? Oh. Alright, yeah. We we'll use this. I think we should sell the other stuff though. Do come again. I'll carefully conserve my strength and endeavor to survive every battle by way of sound strategy and defensive tactics. Okay. No thank you. That was weird. This looks as good a place as any. Maybe that was scripted. Alright, let's put some equipment on. Equipment. We'll change this out to our bow here. And then we can give that to Lucy. Oh yeah, that's gonna boost her magic up. Let's go sell the others. Get some gold. Some sweet, sweet, delicious gold. I've got wares of every ilk. Yes. Yep. Really not worth a lot. Which is fine, but... Okay, our lantern and we got some oil. Pleasure doing business with you. Likewise. That's the way we came in. Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. Sure, what do you Fancy what do you a gander? Got? I find goods for sale. Um What can I wear? Felt cap? <laughs> that looks silly as fuck, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, uh I'll wear the felt cap. Let's see. That doesn't look half bad. Stronger than Oh, uh, yeah, it doesn't look half bad, but it's pretty fucking expensive. Kind of like this right here. Let's see. What does she have? Not sure I'm going to be able to really afford anything for Lucy at the moment. Let's purchase this. Equip purchase. Yeah, sure. Nice. That, I like that. Just auto equip. Oh, I didn't have a hat on already. I was like, wait, shouldn't I have three things to sell? Nope. Always a pleasure. Cool. Hey, oh, you a soldier? To be a surprise to see you arrive in one piece, if not. Hordes of monsters have been plaguing this area of late, you see. We've had to start sending out new recruits to cull them. Is that so? Who went yonder? Lachlan. But I dare say he'll fare all right. Aye, I expect he will. Who was sent out that way then? Ocado. To be honest, sir, I'm a little worried for him. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? The lad can't handle those beasts on his own. This is the first I'm hearing of it. Fie! I want to go to his aid, but we can't just abandon our posts. Say, 
You seem stout of heart. Would you be willing to go in our stead? Tisn't far. Only a short ways out from the main gate. Sure. You've my thanks. Anacardos as well, I'm sure. Uh, setting a priority quest. Some quests are affected by the passage of time and will progress even without the Risen's involvement. Taking on multiple quests at once comes with a risk of being unable to act in time and this can result in unintended consequences. Try to bear it. Try to bear the factor of time in mind when managing your current quests and taking on new ones. Perhaps we ought to hurry, lest we arrive too late to be evade. I agree. So let's go here. Let's go to quests. How do we set it? No. Oh, hit square. Okay. Let's follow the path. Go help this guy. Pawn commands. Go to me. Wait, help. Oh, they gotta no wait. Letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. Oh, where'd those guys come from? Come here, bastard. Ooh, headshot. Nice. One might no. confidently call that a resounding victory. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. Cool, we leveled up to three. It's always nice. See some harpies over there. They're attacking somebody. Is that who we're supposed to be helping? I think so. Here we go again. Nice. I don't suppose begging for a reprieve would get as far with one of this lot. Hell yeah. Okay, well, I don't know why you just did that. But... I shall come at once, Arisen. My curative magics are at your disposal. Wait right there. Are you who I'm supposed to be saving? A grand adventure awaits us. Oh, I just know it. Oh, no. Okay. Um, hello? Is that all of them? Yeah, you have my thanks. I do not believe for a moment I could have slain those creatures without your help. I've only just enlisted. And when I thought this could be the end of me, I... I was paralyzed. You saved me this time, but I won't always be so fortunate. I'll have to train harder, till I have the confidence to face such beasts on my own. Well, I'd best be heading back, but I'll be sure to let my superiors know of your good deed. I hope we meet again someday. Okay. We'd best report back. That's pretty easy. Although, it's being a little glitchy there for a second. I'm a little nervous that it messed up and I wouldn't be able to complete that quest. That would have sucked. I did, had to restart from some save point. Oh. I'm loving this bow, though. Hey, bud, can you move out of the way? Thanks. Appreciate it. Appreciate ya. Oh, there's another one. Shot him in the leg. Yeah, I'm definitely liking the bow quite a bit. 
We'll have to see how the magic archer does later on. Whenever we can get that vocation, that is. How could I have forced all this? Hail, friend! Many thanks for aiding Ocado. Twas a relief to see him return, and none the worse for wear. Aye, that it was. The poor sod might not have made it back alive had you not intervened. Twas a bit too early for him to be seeing actual combat. That much was made well clear. We'll be extending his training period. The instructors here are well known for whipping recruits into shape with their grueling regimes. Ha! <laughs> Speaking of training regimes, I must admit I've half a mind to ask you to join us. We could use someone with your experience. We have okay. succeeded in defending our charge. A sign of good things to come, mayhap. Cool, level One four already. Hoped for a gladder outcome. And we're we're really uh getting some levels. View quest list. Dragon's Wake. Okay, set as priority. Let's go to map. Oh, it doesn't look that far. Just gotta follow the path. About 50 minutes into the video, so probably... Come to think of it, some masters rearrange their party at the drop of a hat. One such a reason dismissed me after only half a day of service. Each to their own. Cool, vocation went up. And Lucy leveled up. Loving the environment. Would seem I've some the vegetation. Outstanding. It just makes you feel like you're really in a forest. You don't always get that feeling in a game. Oh, cool. Lucy's vocation went up too. So, probably after we get through this quest. We're going to end the video and we'll continue on in the next one. We have a choice of where to go, but how to know the path best traveled? I Do don't we decide know. based on our experience or trust to our instincts? Ooh. My guy was getting a little tired there. Oh, hey, there's that ballista that shot down our griffin, you bastards. Dirty rat bastards. Let's put our bow away. We don't need it. At least I don't think we need it right now. Hey, pig. We have found a material. Beast steak. I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Scrag a beast. Okay, so killing pigs are a thing. This game looks absolutely gorgeous, though. Loving the environment. Everything looks like it's meant to be here. They definitely uh, did a good job on the world building. Uh-oh. Uh, oh, it must be saying, oh, we made it to Melv. Stronghold raised by dragon's fire. Huh. Guessing I got attacked by the dragon? So, this is Melv. The scars left by the dragon's assault are plain to see. Mayhap a walk through the streets would help jog your memory. When the arisen appe- Oh, sorry? What the hell happened? Pity about the risen. Didn't mean to cut off the dialogue. Thy 
That is most unfortunate. But it doth not release thee from thy fate. I'm guessing we're supposed to fight the dragon. Oh, holy shit. Oh, holy shit. Get yourself to safety. Definitely reminiscent of Dragon's Dogma 1 with Cassidus and the beach. Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. Thank goodness. How are you feeling? This is the second time I've watched over you like this, isn't it? Um, the second time, you say? You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. It was terrible. I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. But you hung on and by some miracle survived. Um, I think I've become the Arisen. Arisen? I'm afraid I don't understand your meaning. Does it have aught to do with why you were taken to the castle? They said twas so that your wounds could be treated, though I fear you have no memory of this either. I am of the Border Watch. Someone with a risen life. 
like ability tamed to this village, torn in tow. Know you aught of this? Has he come for you? We are to part so soon, then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Till then, take care. Everson. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. I'm glad I found you. The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, you will be received with open arms. Oh, but forgive me. I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Last I saw, he was having a drink at the inn. All right, I think we... What say we gather some information? Okay, sure. The myth. <laughs> Can I finish talking please uh let's let's pause it <laughs> that'll be easier to be able to talk all right everybody i want to start by saying thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video hopefully you all enjoyed the first video of my let's play of dragon's dogma 2 if you did go ahead and hit that thumbs up button if you didn't hit the thumbs down button let me know why down in the comments below it only helps the channel also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.